Swastikas, racial slurs, and satanic graffiti is cleaned up, but deputies aren't ready yet to slap hate crime charges on whomever did this. News Channel 8's Corey Davis joins us now live in Riverview. And Corey, what's the holdup on the uh, hate motive? Why aren't they doing that yet? Good evening to you, Stacey. Well, Hillsborough deputies, they tell us that they're waiting to find out who did this and why before they move forward. But I want to show you here, the symbols are already covered up here on the side of Christ the King Lutheran Church. But people who saw those symbols say they were hateful. Offensive symbols and racial slurs cleaned up but not forgotten. It's just sad. It's just sad. There's no purpose for this. All 130 members of Christ the King Lutheran Church on Big Bend Road are still stunned. Their place of worship vandalized. Well, you have some anger, but I I'm over that. I just want to really get beyond this. But people living in the Summerfield neighborhood next door are still thinking about it, worried and cautious. I do know that in the past we did have a few incidences where uh, we've had kids vandalize some cars in here. This time, neighbors believe kids are also behind the crime at the church. we got to get involved more with this community and get our children occupied. And held responsible for their actions. My feeling is as bad people in all uh, ages and everything. The anger it took to leave these messages and vandalize the property is what some neighbors see as hateful actions. It's a shame that, you know, nowadays that things like that happen. Hillsborough County deputies are working this criminal case, and right now a motive of hate isn't included in the charges, but stiffer penalties could follow. For now, the church leader has forgiven those who are responsible, but warned them of lessons taught within the walls of his building. I don't want them to make any more mistakes that would ruin their lives. And tonight, if the people who did this are caught, they could face several thousand dollars in fines, and pen those penalties could be higher if hate is included in that. Absolutely, and hopefully people are uh, watching, and if they have any idea who's involved, they'll let authorities know. Thank you, Corey.